Hey guys, what's going on? This is Joe Buddha. I am completing my NAM report with the best guitar I played all weekend, which also happens to be in my best friend's house. <clears throat> this is a 1960 Gibson Les Paul Jr. Double Cutaway. This guitar is the best guitar I played all weekend. Nothing at NAM even came close, with the exception of possibly, possibly the Jerry Donahue Fret King model. That was really cool. Um, this guitar is not really all original. It's been had a lot of work done to it. But it does have the original pickups, all the original electronics, bumblebee caps and everything. Um, some lunatic apparently did some work and had the, uh, the body done, strings through the body like on a flying V. I don't understand it myself. Uh, replacement bridge, replica tuners, new frets, which were plecked when they were put on, but the original pickup. And uh, through the same Richie Cotton uh, 100 watt model, Cornford. Now, one pickup guitar, you'd think it wouldn't have a lot of tonal options, but on this guitar, the tone knob actually makes a huge difference. Uh, check this out. I'm going to start with the volume, just about five, four and a half, and now I'm going to turn the tone down to about five, maybe four. Beautiful, huh? Now check this out. I'm going to turn the volume up a little bit more. It's going to sound like a neck pickup. Yeah, man, this is the best guitar I've played all weekend. I was at NAMM this weekend. Played tons of different stuff by tons of different people, and this is, this stands out as the best one. 1960 Gibson Les Paul Jr. Single P90 pickup, original pickup, bumblebee caps. What a great guitar, man. Really cool. And I found it at my best friend Steve's house. So that's it. See you guys later. This is Joe Buddha.